Trapti here from Guiding Works International Business Coaching. Want to talk to you about some more tips in our series on how to stay uber, uber productive and have fun in the meantime. So one of the things that I love to do is I love to learn. I love to take courses. And that's a great way to keep joy in work. Okay. Can I manage to do everything in my business myself? Absolutely not. I have a great team and huge kudos to my team. It can be extremely humbling, but it's very important to admit what you don't know. For me, a lot of the times it's technology. I know for a lot of you out there, technology is probably a breeze. But for me, it's not. So I'm going to use it as an example. So here's the thing. When you can, get yourself some help in your business. But always keep, so this is the double way to think about it. Always keep kind of your finger on it. So for example, I have a great marketing team. Her name's Heidi. Highly recommend. So when the two of us work, take you a little bit behind the scenes right now, yes, she knows the technology inside and out. Absolutely. But do we discuss strategy? We do. I'm the business owner. You've got to. You've got to take some reins as a business owner. We talk about what we want to do and the strategy. So I'm going to give you another example. If you go to the doctor's office, yes, it's important to ask for help. Are you the expert? No, maybe not. But it's your body, just like it's your business. And it's really super important to know, even if the doctor is telling you to do this and that and the other, to research as much as you can. It's your body, your health, you've got to take care of it. You can't just completely say, Okay, here you go. In fact, sometimes you might even want to get two opinions, right? So, even if it's humbling to ask for help, remember that balance in your business. Ask for help and try and keep a control. Bye for now. Talk to you guys later. Karen Trepti, Guiding Works International Business Coaching. I'm here to support.